we have a friend out here, um, and we met him. I, I think we met him in Europe, but we, he's from like the U.S. And we were hanging out in San Francisco, and he'd just come back from Brazil and had like this crazy stack of records. And he played Sonos in Memorias, uh, the Erasmo Carlos album, and we were just like, "Oh my God, this is crazy!" Uh, really, really into the, that whole album, and then got more into like his music, and that was one of our links to like checking out a bunch of other Brazilian stuff. Sei que o mundo pega muitos quilos. Like our love of Brazilian music, jazz, folk, psych is like endless, and we're always trying to find more. And we have a couple friends who live here and show us lots of amazing music and sell us 45s. And I think that's kind of where our minds kind of sit now as um, creatives is more in the world of like expansion. Um, you know, being able to apply our knowledge of like instruments and theory and sounds and then apply that to writing and exploring our creativity then maybe making samples and submitting those to different producers and stuff like that um, allows us to just you know create a sonic palette that we've now found a deep love and same with like record collecting and you know sample discography and artist catalogs so